everybody so I'm back um, with this month which this month is July 2017 um, I'm back with the July 2017 ipsy glam bag and I it is so freaking hot which is why I have not shot this video well that's one reason plus I've been really tired lately but um I am looking and feeling a hot mess tonight but I'm determined to get this video up and hopefully edited soon even though it's like at the end of July um but yeah so anyway this month I received my Ipsy bag in a golden Meller. so um I don't know what the deal is but it's different it's it's different so I've already opened this I just yeah I went ahead and did that um, cause I didn't know when I'd get around to doing this video and I was impatient about finding out what was inside my bag and plus I want to try to review some of these products before the end of the month. So, um, let's go ahead and get into it. And so first off, I noticed that I had this little catalog thing and it's about the whole Ipsy cash program that they have, which, um, I'm not too knowledgeable about it. Um, I've kind of like I've seen the emails, um, but from what I understand, it's basically like an Ebates um, that Ipsy is offering, where if you you can go through Ipsy and purchase um, cosmetics from like companies they've partnered with. I noticed that they have like some higher end companies like Mac, Bobby Brown, Clinique, Estee Lauder. Smashbox. I mean, it's just a little catalog that they put together of different things you can buy, and apparently you get like five dollars cash from Ipsy that you can use towards your first purchase or something. Um, yeah. So I, I don't know. So that was in my bag. Um, first thing I noticed, and then this month's bag is this little, and I'm going to end up butchering this, but this. Gouda Tama, and which um, I've kind of looked this up a bit, but it's like a really popular thing in Japan right now, I believe, or over in, just in the continent of Asia. But um, apparently, it's a little over easy egg that's kind of, I don't know, I guess he's like what Grumpy Cat was here to there. I, I don't know. That's just my summary of it. But anyway, so inside the bag, we have, and I've neglected to do this, which um, I don't think I did a video for last month. Lizzie Sparkle did, I believe. But um, yeah, I think I neglected this card in my prior video, my, I guess it had been May video. But yeah, so um, it even says that over easy. Um, talking about Gudatama. Uh, yeah. So, little card. Yay. I don't know if you can hear my fan running in the background, but that's what that noise is. If it's kind of loud and obnoxious, I apologize. But I am going to, like, melt if I don't have my fan right now. So, let's get on to the goods in the bag. So, first off, we have the... And I put it in there, funky. Um, the Ofra Cosmetics um, Gold Rush Eyeshadow. And which it's just kind of like a rose goldy color. I actually am wearing it on my lid right now along with that Makeup Revolution Golden Lights Highlighter. And um, with the old Fergie Shimmer Eyeshadow Primer. But I've kind of got that whole look going on on my lid. I don't know if that's even showing up um yeah so I thought I'd try it out and it's 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 a nice like rose gold color um um I feel like with Ipsy like now every time I get an eyeshadow it's pretty much redundant like the colors seem to be really redundant and very similar and I guess that's just because based off of my coloring like um fair skin blonde hair blue eyes I guess they kind of profile that like I know like um, golds and browns are kind of like the recommended for the coloring but I'm just kind of like 
where the bright eyeshadows were the more vibrant, bright, exciting eyeshadows. Um, but I, I do like receiving eyeshadows. It's just like, and I like the colors, but it just seems like every time I get an eyeshadow now, it's like in pretty much almost identical to an eyeshadow I would have received like two months prior. And I even got like a little eyeshadow palette in either my May or June back. I can't remember. That was pretty much redundant to one I received last year. Like the color scheme was almost the same. So I'm just kind of like, come on, could you mix it up a bit with the colors or something? But I guess it's just like a safe thing that they do. Just to play it safe for most people since I know a lot of people do like neutrals instead of wild vibrant colors but I like wild vibrant colors so whatever um, and then next up I got this brush by no or the when to say no Susan it says so Susan is the brand and it's just like a blender brush oh um, it does have soft nice bristles that's the main thing I look for when I receive these brushes and I so far Ipsy's on top of the game with these brushes like it seems like every brush I've ever received has been a really nice soft bristled good quality brush so okay for that next up we have the what's the brand I think it's Bella Pierre it's a banana setting powder, which I have been wanting one of these. Um, I don't know. I haven't tried it out. I've heard that sometimes banana setting powder is kind of a little too yellow for, um, for like fair skin. Like, I don't know. I've been wanting to try this out. And again, I have yet to do so. I need to do so. But I'm glad that I finally received something like this because it seems like everybody gets these and I've never received one. So that's my chance to try it out and that's cool. And then we have received this, what's it, 111 Skin Space Defense Bright Eye Lift gel which this seems like it'll be good I look this up and I think like a full-size product is I could be very wrong but I think a full-size product is like half an ounce and it sells for I think the com it was like in pounds but I think the converted um, rate was like a hundred and twenty or hundred and forty dollars for like half an ounce and this is like point one seven ounces um so it's probably it's not quite it's almost two fifths of the product of the full size so this is a pretty like good I mean for the price of the actual product it's a pretty good size sample but um I've been wanting like really good skincare products and I've actually found a moisturizer that I really like from a previous bag that I've noticed a lot of actual improvement in my skin which I never expected that from a moisturizer when I look at a moisturizer just as long as it doesn't like break me out and as long as it keeps my skin moisturized without like drying it out because there are some moisturizers out there that do kind of dry out my skin instead of moisturize it um but I've been looking for good quality skincare products, which I'm kind of afraid, like, something that is this high dollar, like, if I really love it, it's going to hurt that I love it so much, because I know I sure as heck am not spending $120 or $140, definitely not $140 on, like, a full-size product, but it's nice to have, like, something that's higher in, just, to, like, as a luxury treat, so, um, and plus, it's an eye serum gel sort of deal so I mean it's never too early to start like taking care of your skin and focusing on those areas especially since I've had a lot of damage from like using acne products on my skin um, over the years and so this should be um, this should be interesting to 
try out. And then finally, I received the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Deep Dive Cleansing Gel. So, um, so far I've liked the Tarte products I've tried uh, from the Ipsy bag. Um, and it's a skin cleansing gel, so sounds good. Um, I have yet to try it, obviously, but... Again, I like receiving nice skincare products, so this will give me a chance to try this out. Um, and usually, like, in my experience, gel cleansers have been pretty good. Like, I haven't run across a really bad gel cleanser yet, so, um, this should be fun to try. So, that is it for my July Ipsy bag, and, uh, so far I'm not can canceling my bag. I keep like it seems like every video I'm like uh, this may be my last month I may cancel it but I'm gonna keep holding on to it unless I just get a really horrible bag but anyways so that's all for now and thank you for watching